welcome to Val Plays Mass Effect. This is going to be episode number one. Before we get started, I want to show a little bit what I've done before. I've gotten a, uh, I played the game before, at the beginning. I was a Earthborn Soul Survivor, played it through as the default setting, so I was a soldier. Got to level 37, played it about 14 hours. So I have, uh, I played with assault rifles, I unlocked assault rifles. I was going to play as an adept with assault rifles because that's similar to how I want to play in the second and third games as an adept. They get small machine guns um, and singularity and all that. But instead I decided I wanted to play as a vanguard with singularity. Um, pretty much play as an adept but get uh, medium armor. Pretty much what it's out to be. And uh, the ability to refresh all your abilities. So it makes make this game a lot easier. So I also made an adept, level 6, spent a couple hours got singularity unlocked so now i'm going to welcome start to alliance my new career. military database classified information play as requested a, uh, male ship and renegade i'm going to play the renegade way establishing this time. secure connection first time i played this paragon confirmed and i hear the uh, outcomes are mostly the same you know the major choices i'll still make however i want to make them but uh, the voice interaction is supposed to be good so make a custom Please mail. log in to access your profile. Val. Val plays Mass Effect. Oh no, you have to pick all your stuff. Oh, this game is good. I uh, played this one and I played about halfway Warning. through the second. Data corruption detected. Maybe not even halfway. But I haven't even touched the third one yet. It has been out for a little while. So I wanted to play all three. Please reconstruct the beginning profile. For my uh, channel. Confirm pre-service history. You'd be an Earthborn to get a bonus to uh, Ruth uh, Renegade. Spacer gets a bonus to Paragon. Colonist is the one in between. So one Confirm Renegade. psychological profile. Same thing here. Soul Survivor's Paragon. Ruthless is Renegade. Confirm Renegade. military specialization. Vanguard. And my bonus ability. Singularity. Confirm facial identification. We'll go with that. That's fine. The base is good. Profile reconstruction complete. Singularity, Vanguard, Earthborn, Ruthless. It's my character, Val. Val Shep. Could be a good, fun game. Identification confirmed. Normal defense. Uh, I don't think I even want them to do defense because they'll blow their barriers and stuff like that. Maybe I should have a bit. I don't know. I'm not super good at these games, so I may even back them down to casual. Uh, maybe I should do it at the beginning when the game's harder for me, but I don't whatever. You guys can watch me die, pathetically. I normally don't play shooters. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets, learned to look out for himself. He got most of his unit killed on Torfin. He gets the job done, no matter what the cost. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Say the civilizations of the galaxy call it the dot dot dot. Good game. I like cinematic story stuff. The Arcturus Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Commander. Mass and destination. The relay is hot, acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Board 
screen. Approach run has begun. I do want to play one time as Femship, just to have all the female voice lines. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500 K. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. 1500 kilometers. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. That's enough. You're soldiers. Act like it. Sorry, Commander. Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? So most of the time, I'm just going to quick click the bottom one here, the Renegade option. Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm going to pay for it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's always in a bad mood. Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Unless, of course, it's like a, a thing to say, no, I don't want to do that, or another type of option. Codex, I'm not going to go through the Codex and make you guys listen to all that. Even though this stuff is Roughly cool. Roughly 1,200 years ago, the Turians... Not gonna do that. I'll read all that stuff in my own time. But for cinematics, right along I won't talk. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? I'm on my way to give him a status update right now. With all Get due out of respect, my way. sir, maybe he'll finally tell you what we're really doing out here. Info's on a need to know basis, Presley. Just follow the orders you're given. Understood, Commander. That's right, man. I grew Pump up in Prime Dock. It's not the kind of place Spectres visit. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this mission. That's crazy. What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real action. Some real I action. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Marines are meant to fight. You just fix us up when we're done. I know how things work, Get Commander. In the kitchen. <laughs> I've seen my share of combat, but it's foolish to go looking for trouble. You could both take a lesson from the captain. He's not afraid of combat, but he knows the value of restraint, too. Sorry, Doc, but this waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before, not one with a specter on board. Do your job, follow my orders, and there won't be any problems. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself on Torfin. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. This mission isn't about personal glory, Corporal. We have a job to do. Don't do anything stupid to mess it up. That's don't worry, right. sir. Don't get my way. I'm not going to screw this up. The captain's waiting for me. Goodbye, Commander. Renegade plus two. Oh, yeah. Take those renegade options while I got them. Easy ones. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to, Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. I'm a marine, not some tourist on vacation. It's more than just a tourist destination, isn't it, Shepard? Eden Prime is a symbol of your people, a perfect little world on the edges of your territory. Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Are you trying to scare me, Spectre? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? 
I think it's about time we told the commander what's really going on. This mission what's is really far more than on. a simple shakedown run. Obviously. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. What's the payload, Captain? A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. What else can you tell me? This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. We can handle this on our own. Unless something goes wrong. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. Like hell he is. Since when do we answer to the Spectres? You're smart enough to know how things work, Commander. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. I was impressed when I studied the reports from Torfin. A grim business, but you got the job done. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I don't like people making decisions about my future. This isn't about you, Shepard. Humanity needs this. <laughs> We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. First of several. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Shotgun and Nihilus assault rifle on my back that I can't mission. use yet. Never been able to use the assault rifle, really. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. I'm not going to do all those investigative side stuff. Get down! Cuts out after that. No comm traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go what in about survivors, in. Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top nice priority. Approaching drop point one. Skip the conversation. Nihilus, about 15 minutes into this first episode, and I'm finally going to get to uh, move around and shoot stuff. Nihilus will scout oh, yeah. out ahead. He'll feed you status story. reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Ready and able, sir. I guess I was a the mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! We are approaching drop point two.
Points in the pistol. Caden, I want to get uh, some electronics from him. First aid. Jenkins. Well, Jenkins doesn't really need anything now, does he? We're going to give him saw rifles for like five seconds. Singularity. Boom. Number one. Let's go ahead and put uh, throw and then warp right there. Wow, well, who am I kidding? Hard, Commander. Hostiles everywhere. Keep your guard up. Q to holster, Q to check out. No. Let's go. Singularity. First time. Level one. I shouldn't have it at level one. Oh, but I do. Okay, to level. Three more points. Increases the radius. I'm gonna probably work up my other powers a little bit, make them more stronger, <coughs> and then work up Singularity. Recharge time, that's good. And I'll probably uh, do this stuff. Let's unlock Marksman first. Basic protection, 6%, improved damage. One point's probably really good for everything. First, I'll get armor a little bit later. Do that. Okay, barrier. I think we're good, Commander. Yep, he's dead. Rip right through his shields. We're at a chance. Leave him. We need to finish the mission. Aye, aye, Leave sir. him. Cold hard. Renegade, too. Stand out and die. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Armor plating, huh? Oh, huh? I'm not 
not scared. I think we got I mean, I'm only playing on normal. Can't be that bad. Oh wait, what happened? Did I, I lost my... I somehow untoggled that. Definitely not for children. We're shooting stuff. For young children. Singularity, anyway. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? I need a status report. Now. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth yeah. haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Stay here. Lieutenant Olenko and I will take care of this. Let me come with you, sir. The guests slaughtered you. my unit. Give me a chance to get even. She knows the area, Commander. And we could use the extra firepower. Fine. Just don't forget who's in charge. Understood, Commander. You give the orders and I'll follow them. Then Move it. Suck it. <laughs> Equipment screen. Equip the pistol she gave me. Oh, I don't have a gun mod. She uses an assault rifle. Well, Caden. Yeah, I don't care about Caden too much. The Probably won't be using him. Look at that. This is just better in all respects. There we go. Took that out. I'll switch to this armor. Put it back in. Boom. Feels pretty good with uh, points in it.
This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Let's get moving. Williams, where's the camp? It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. In. There we go. Oh no, wrong tab. I want the U tab. There we go. Upgrade time. Let's go ahead and give myself a barrier. Kidding overload. Actually, this adrenaline burst. Assault rifle training. There you go. Max, you can have her level. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Oh God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? What did they do? Some overheating, I know. You can push that one. No black hole out. Prime will never be the same again. Huh. That door, it's closed. Security locks engaged. Humans. Thank the Maker. Thank Hurry, the Maker. Close the door before they come back. How did you end up in this shed? We hid here during the attack. They must have come here for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Drug him. And with that ominous word, I think we're going to end it for this first episode. Continue on here and finish off this first mission next time.
Thank you all for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoy. See you guys later.